pot of acid. Sweet, just what I needed. What am I supposed to use this on? It's filled with acid. I want to get that. That is. <laughs> Okay. What? What is this place? Journal. Stairs of collapse. Find a way to climb back up. Okay. I'm guessing I have to use the acid on this wall. Oh, this wall is broken already. Oh no. I said it works best on this stuff. Or on flesh. Something like that. Cannot use the item this way. To use up all my oil. So I'm gonna be running through this. to go back down there. But I have to go down there first place. Okay. Um it's filled with acid. I know that I'm gonna have to go down there. Oh, why did I not open these chests? No, maybe because I can't. That one I can now. No object to use that item on. I don't want to walk around as nothing. Oh, I can use it to light. No. Maybe I can use it like in here. Um. On this thing? No. Take this tinder box. We have five. It said organic materials work where it works best on organic materials. You could use hot objects to get oh okay, I get it. Well, that's not what I was trying to do, but I guess I can anyways. Okay. That was that took way too long. <clears throat> Why is this stuff? It's gonna explode on me. It's gonna explode. That's a lot of it. Meatballs. Um, what if I use it on this stuff? Can I use it on the item this way? What is this stuff doing? I don't get it. I guess this is the only place I haven't been. 
um, oil. Scared me cockroaches. Quit doing that. Quit doing that. Oil. Okay. This is what I'm gonna need to use that on then. What the heck? I like not close enough or something? No, oh, I'm up against it. There'll be some way to use that. Must be missing something. Stupid cockroaches, stop making those noises. The other person up there. Oh, let me guess, I have to go down here. This is where I had to use it. They may be torn by hand tools or by acid. Oh, refinery. Sounds scary. It needs to not be so dark in my room. <laughs> I don't like it at all. Oh no, so dark. Ow, oh, that hurts my eyes. It's so bright. It sure is dark in here. <laughs> yes, I said that. and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason? For the darkness, that is. Stay close. Be careful. Not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Daniel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. Oh no. I don't know what that is. I want to get out of here. There's enemies near? Okay, okay, don't touch me. Don't you look at me. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, I'm by myself. Boy. I don't know what that stuff is. Oh god. Man, I opened doors so quick. I don't mean to do that. That scared me. That scared me so much. Check the Jew. 1839. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it, 
lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? Yeah, there's a complete orb. You just don't know how to put puzzle pieces together. I just slam these doors. Oh, why are there so many doors? Blocked from the other side. Building the back room is locked off. Find another way in. Okay. This is the main room again, isn't it? I wonder what this stuff is. this journal even though it was intended for my journey to Africa this must be something very important I just know it I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together but it's been more difficult than one might think the pieces are behaving strangely they seem to change color shape and texture but ever so slightly yesterday I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Boxes. Start using these things. Wish I'd been here already. Okay, these chairs were all up last time, weren't they? <laughs> I like the torch is better. Oh my god, that made me jump so much. <laughs> oh no. Oh god. <laughs> I hate that stuff. Oh, I, I almost fell out of my chair and everything. Oh 
don't, I feel like I shouldn't light these rooms. This one might be good. I'm scared to be in this main room because of that monster. Alright, I've been around there in circles multiple times. where I came from though. What am I s I don't I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going or what I'm supposed to be doing. I don't know that I have to find I know that much, but I don't know how. There's got to be another sort of pushy-pulley thing like I did with the books. Or like some way to move these... These things. I forget which door it was that was locked. This one? Oh, it's going to be behind these boxes here. The fragrance. The master's rose. Yeah. You can't fit through there. What's going on? 